Good morning from Mount Meru. This is John Proctor reporting for Green Tourism. Uh, speaking to you from 4,562 meters with my ranger friend, Bahati. Bahati. Bahati Juma. Yeah. And, uh, <coughs> and Quentin, who's doing the filming, thankfully. He's waving. And we have made it up a very tough mountain. We have a little more to go, you can see, and it's still very tough, but I think we're going to make it this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Andrea and Marion and, um, and Jamie and, um, and everybody else, and oh, I'm forgetting who else should I remember? I should remember. I should remember. Gosh, it's altitude sickness. I have to claim altitude sickness now. <laughs> it's very tough to remember everything when you're up here. Uh, Martin, obviously, who has to climb this mountain next just to prove that uh, he can do it too. But um, also for Teresa and Pamela, and of course uh, for Catherine and uh, for Neil and everybody else who works with Green Tourism. It's great when you take on a challenge like this I, for about an hour. The last hour I thought I wouldn't make it. I really thought I'm going to have to go back down, this is too much. And for a long time I thought this is too much, I'm just going, never going to make it. But I'm going to make it. It's good. I think doing impossible things is, in, is, is important. And uh, although my fingers are a little frostbitten, and uh, it's been the toughest mountain ever I've climbed. It's, uh, it's been a pleasure. And um, yeah, let's all try and do these things. So I'll see you when I'm back down, if I make it, if I don't fall off the mountain. If I do, then this is the last message. So uh, enjoy life.